legacy is important, especially if you want to be remembered. Um, as a as a kid, right? I always had these. If if, if, if I'm honest, at when I growing up, I didn't always have the best sense of knowing myself. Um, I used to always doubt myself. I used to always be negative, tell myself I couldn't do certain things. It really took me years and years to know that I'm an asset to anybody I come across. Rather you're a stranger, you're a coworker, to me, I'm an asset. And you may not know it or not, and, and maybe that's speaking too confidently, but I've I've grown to have this confidence that if I've if 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 I have been in any type of encounter with you, I'ma uplift you. I'ma hold you to a very high standard because I because I really feel as though that, you know, you can do it. You know what I mean? So I think that one day that that will probably end up being my legacy. And legacy is very important to me. Name, being reputable, being a very reputable person who has a track record of doing these things. You get what I mean? Like, a lot of people don't really think about that, though. Like, a lot of people really just think that, you know, it's for the now. We're so taught. That nowadays, everything is so fast. Everything is moving at a constant, consistent pace. Everything is move, move, move. Things are changing, changing, changing. But sometimes you got to think about the future, man. Even if even if that's in hindsight of for you personally, sometimes you have to sit still and just think about the future. We're so caught up in the past, the present. The past is gone. Tomorrow ain't promised. That's what they always say, right? So even though tomorrow ain't promised, you still can think about the future. Give yourself. Matter of fact, think about this question. What would you like for the person 10 years from now? What would you like for that person to say about you? What are you doing? So if you're 20, what do you want the 30 year old self to say about you? I am so glad I saved some money. I am so glad I took a chance in doing this podcast. I'm so glad I'm doing what I want to do. What do you want to be remembered as? 10 years from now, if you can honestly say that you became a better person than you were 10 years before, that's all that matters. It's all about growing too. But legacy is very, very, very important in my opinion, right? Um, Second thing, right? So uh, there's one other thing that we're going to impact. Um, And this is probably going to end the episode. I kind of just want to do like a filler episode. But um, I'll leave you. I'll leave you with this, right? Be yourself. Everything that I've talked about today is just simply, is just as simple as just being yourself. You can be yourself, but don't be complacent with just being yourself. Be willing to achieve a higher standard or set a higher standard for yourself. Be willing to accept whatever comes with your actions. Every action has a reaction that has consequences. If you as a man are willing to accept consequences for what happens for whatever decision you make, that's all you can really ask for. Stay out the way. Sit down and observe the environment that's around you and move accordingly. That's all you can really do. A lot of people are going to have hidden agendas, ulterior motives. They're going to push their own narrative. You're going to be faced with a lot of obstacles in life. The only thing you can do, stay true to yourself, stay solid, stand on what you believe in, regardless of whatever the circumstances is, keep your head down, keep going, be blessed. That's all you can do in this world. You cannot worry about what you cannot control. Worry about what you can control and what's going to bring you peace and happiness. That's all we can do in this world. We cannot harp on anything we cannot control. But at the end of the day, 
be yourself and be your genuine self. Don't let nobody else tell you anything otherwise. Continue, continue to go the straight way. If a lot of people are going, making a right or making a left, you go straight. Don't let nobody else take that from you. If you worked hard to get a promotion at a job and somebody else felt as though that they should have got it, so therefore they're bringing you hate, so be it. It wasn't meant for them to have it. It was meant for you to have it. We all have 24 hours out of the day. How we choose to utilize those 24 hours dictate how we move every single day. So if you, in 24 hours, been busting your butt every single day to the best of your abilities, making sure that you have a way to provide for yourself or if you have a provide for, for your family, if you have a kid, you have a wife, girlfriend, whatever, do that. Push that foot forward and do whatever it is that you have to do in this world. Find your purpose. Nipsey always said, find your purpose or you're wasting it. You can't just be living life just to live life. There's got to be a reason why you were put on this earth. And I feel like I was put on this earth to inspire, to be able to be genuine to different people. You get what I mean? Um, That's really what all today's episode is about. Again, this is going to be the first episode. Um, I ain't going to lie. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a little bit nervous, y'all. Like, I'm a little bit nervous about this. But, again, I appreciate. I welcome all feedback. I take all criticism. But that will conclude episode one of the Am I Tripping podcast. So, at any given point, if I'm tripping about anything or if there's any comment that you would like to make, please let me know. Do not hesitate to hit me up. Let me know what's going on. Link will be in the description for all my social medias. I will be dropping like uh, th this episode probably ASAP, to be honest with you. Um, I'm going to be dropping this ASAP. I'm going to edit it, chop it up, make it look good. But again, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate everything you guys have done for those that have supported me with my previous content or for people that are just now converting over. Thank you. I appreciate it. There will be more episodes to come. I love you guys. I'm going to see y'all on the next episode. And be great today. Be amazing today. Have a wonderful and safe productive day.